Early on, it should have been Florida State waving the flags. White flags. Miami dominated the first half. Leonard Conley, who ran for 138 yards on the ground, scored twice to stake the Canes to a 17-0 lead. When quarterback Craig Erickson hit Lamar Thomas on this 10-yard touchdown toss, it was 24-0. FSU couldn't get on the board until late in the first half when Brad Johnson found Lawrence Dossie. The senior caught 13 balls today. He bounced off two defenders here to score Florida State's only points of the first half. The Seminoles got back in this game when Amp Lee scored on this short run to make it 24-16, but Miami put it away with a crunching drive. Steve McGuire kept pounding away at the FSU defense. He finally scored to make it 31-16, and this one was basically over. Well, Miami's 31-22 win today here at the Orange Bowl wasn't one of the classic games Seminole and Hurricane fans are used to seeing between these two teams. Miami will take it. Hey, after all, number one Notre Dame lost today too, so the Canes are right back in the national championship picture. Oh yeah, we, we knew we were back in the hunt. You know, we, we can't worry about those things and you know, that really doesn't affect us at all. You know, we just got to keep going the rest of the season and play each game one game at a time. We have a lot of little things still uh, to get better at. And uh, the, with the weeks to come, uh, we have a lot more season left and we're going to get better. The momentum is going to get stronger and stronger. We got that, that bitter taste out of our mouths. You know, last year we left on the bus and everybody's coming around with around the bus, you know, having 24-10 score everywhere and it's doing all this and that, you know, it, it messed with our morale a little bit. You know, we came into this game with our mind set up that we're not going to leave with a loss. FSU's title hopes meantime took a direct hit. How badly does it hurt? I can't imagine. I can't imagine. Maybe not, but imagining what could have been for Florida State will have to do, at least until next year. Reporting from the Orange Bowl in Miami, Ken Tomash, Wink Sports Tonight.